Hello YouTube, Jeff Steele here with Steele Navigator and I want to speak about professions or jobs and ways to make money for convicted felons or individuals with a criminal background, whether that be misdemeanors, felonies. A lot of companies today will not hire individuals with a criminal record for one reason or another. and. I don't agree with it. I think everybody enjoys a real uh, a second chance, and it's a real waste that society and most companies in general just overlook a willing, determined, and energetic workforce out there. And oftentimes, are more motivated and harder workers than than individuals that have all the opportunities in the world. So what I did was put together a list of professions or jobs that I felt could really pay big money, yet have relatively low startup costs. And someone could start it as soon as they get out of a stint in, in jail or prison. I also thought about professions whereby, say, tattoos and piercings, if one had had that, that it wouldn't be a, an intimidation type factor. So I also thought about that. So I got a list of 10 here, and I'm going to start with number 10. And one is a professional dog walker or pet walker. I know people who get $25 for each walking session per dog. So say somebody has one dog, that's that's fifty dollars a day right there for one dog. If they got five dogs, that's two hundred and fifty dollars a day for for one household. So this this money can rack up rather quick. Now granted it, it can be a dirty job of course picking up pet waste, but if one can overlook that and and see the real money in it because most people, they want to have pets or dogs, yet they're so busy that they don't want to take time or they're out of town and, and need to outsource that. So that's one option. Nine is becoming a, a vlogger, starting a, a YouTube channel, or some type of social media whereby filming one's experiences, or docu filming documentaries with a, a cell phone camera, GoPro camera, something of that nature, and uploading. Next would be a writer or blogger, writing, writing a book, regular book, or starting a blog online, or it's just text. And someone that has done a stint in jail or prison, they could write about that experience, and such a book would sell. People are very interested in such things. Number seven, something in the skilled trades industry, such as a plumber or electrician, HVAC, or something in the field of septic tanks. They're tough, they can be dirty jobs, but there is a lot of money in it. And as far as I'm aware, workers are, are really needed in these areas. Again, they can be dirty jobs, it's hard work, a lot of times but can pay big 100 300,000 a year if one builds up a, a clientele next would be a, an arborist or a logger working for a tree cutting company or a logging outfit I know for a fact someone right off the street could get a job on a tree cutting tr crew make 300 bucks cash a day now it's tough Hard work, dangerous work, climbing trees with a chainsaw hanging from your belt. A lot of times working a chainsaw with one arm, very dangerous work, but payout is significant. I've heard in the Georgia area, $300 cash a day at least. Next profession, number five, it's an option, becoming an exotic dancer. One can make well over what the arborists or loggers make. So it's, it's an option, something to consider. 
Number four is becoming a bartender. For example, bars in Atlanta, one could make 500 a night, 1,200 a night, 1,500 a night. On the big nights, could make 2,500, 3,000 in a night. It's, it's possible. A lot of it's cash. Next would be number three, and that would be starting a, a hand car wash business. Most car washes today are automated. They don't do detailed work. And also, the machines oftentimes put micro scratches on vehicles, and, and people, if they have the option, they'd much rather prefer, to, prefer a hand car wash. And depending on the service, that can be anywhere from $15 for a basic wash all the way up into the hundreds for a detailing job. Lots of money to be had there. Not just automobiles, but with boats as well. Number two is becoming a barber. Someone can become a barber without having to go to school. They can work under an apprenticeship. And first year could make 50 to 60,000 depending on how, how many heads they cut. So that's, a, that's something to really consider and one can work, work their way up, open their own shop, can become a millionaire in, in a few years. I've seen it happen. And number one, of course, is starting one's own business and, and one thing or another, whether that be a, a hot dog stand, starting a YouTube channel. It could, it could really be anything. And you're, the own, you're your own boss. You're your own HR department. So there's, you make the rules in that situation, no matter what it is. That's the ultimate goal. So just a few ideas where startup costs are low chance to make some real good money. Some of it's hard work, but that's just what needs to be done. And I, I just hope, hope this helps somebody out there. Please like, subscribe, comment down below, start a conversation. Thanks for watching.